here on this B short and then he plays he picks with his right hand a bit slower something like that. It is hard for me to show you slowly. You should just make up your own version with your right hand. Okay? So good luck with that. Then it goes to So with his left hand it's basically hold the B shape but you only move the other fingers so everything together slowly so it's always the same shape with his right hand still hold the same shape but he pressed down the G string, B string and E string on the second fret. So you get this chord. And he plays the same thing with his right hand but from the lower strings.
that's the pattern you should follow so so it should sound like this So you see I'm not always playing the exactly same thing but you should just follow the rhythm. Then it goes back to this again. So, from the beginning, he plays this two times, two times, then he goes to the low strings, he plays also that two times, then he goes back to the beginning two times. So two, two, two. So now we have come to the chord section of the song. Fourth fret on the A string, sixth fret on the D and G, fifth fret on the B string, and fourth fret on the E string. So then to B the second fret on the A string, fourth fret on the D, G and B. Okay, then it goes to fourth fret on the E string, sixth fret on the A and D, and fourth fret on the G, B and E. same shape, you slide it down two steps to the second fret, but you now add your long finger on the third fret on the G string. So from the beginning, You repeat that four times. And now it's time for the solo. And for the solo, you should beforehand record the beginning part. Record this on your looper, and now it's time for the solo. Then he plays during the solo something like this. Okay, so it's 7th fret on the B, 8, 4, 5, 4, 2, open. Back to the two, four, and open. So from the beginning, yeah, and he repeats that two times. The other cool thing he does, he starts off on the seventh fret on the B string, and he waits, then one more time. To the 11 and 12. So. And then he goes to the 9th fret on the D string and on the 6th fret on the G string. And then he 
lifts up back and forth with his ring finger on the 8th fret on the G string. Okay, so these three notes. Okay. He plays it fast and quiet. It sounds a little bit like U2. Then he goes here on the 4th fret on the G string, 1st fret on the D string. Slides down 1 fret to the 2nd fret on the D string, then on the 4th fret on the D string, back to the 2nd fret. And he repeats that 2 times. He often repeats everything two times. So then the last lick he does is he goes here on the 6th fret on the E string and he pulls up and down. So it's basically to this note. But he pulls. Then 6th fret, 7th fret on the B string and 4th fret on the E string a couple of times and then uh, in the video I show you you can improvise in B major So good luck with uh, the improvisation and the song and if you have any other song requests please put them down in the comments. Enjoy! Okay.